Hey guys, Jin Lux here, back with our semi-blind playthrough of Mormon. Last time, oh, here comes Manny. Well, then I'll wait a second to load. Um, you don't want either of those, Manny Cat. Uh, last time we explored some of the stuff of Kogarun. Found several dead heroes, which I thought was interesting. And, um, looted them. And, uh, found some other stuff, ebony weapons, glass stuff. It's really neat. I really like... Are you gonna... Are you gonna come into my lap again? Crazy one. Um, I do really like... I, I kind of... I appreciate several things. One. One is that you can kind of see how the series... Evolves. You know... Presumably Daggerfall did stuff and they're like, Well, this wasn't... People didn't really like this or this wasn't as fun as we thought it was gonna be. So in Morrowind, let's try something else. Morrowind comes along and they're like, yeah, enchanted items are too powerful or or uh, everything's too easy. So let's in Oblivion, let's introduce level scaling. Right. And then they're like, no, that's too hard. Let's change that in Oblivion. And, and that's really neat. But the other thing is I really appreciate how rare a lot of this stuff is like, don't here. Come on. Come on into the lap. Come on into the lap. Into the lap. He just wants to sit there and like put his hands on the mice, on the mouse, or his paws, and that's not it's not acceptable, my cat. It's unacceptable. Yes it is. You were in your heated cat bed. Why did you want to get out? Were you not warm enough? Maybe you got too warm? Hmm? I don't know. Look at this belly. It's really bad. With him, at least Jack will walk around the keyboard. Manny tries, but he doesn't try very hard. He's like, I'll do it, but only if I want to. Okay, here we go. We're cuddling. Oh, we're cuddling now. You're a cuddling fool, Manny. You're a cuddling fool. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my. Oh. This is love, though. I don't mind being loved. You know? Right? Well, let's load anyway. We'll figure out what to do. Right, so we're in Kogarun, in the Hall of Maki, with these flies. Dead heroes, which I really like that they're... I don't know what this is supposed to be, the... This thing. <clears throat> but we need to... What are you smelling when I breathe? What do you smell? I don't have any feather rings of feather. I wonder if this works. Or, no, hang on. It's like fortify strength. Personality. We need to figure out what to do with these. The ball Molagmer as well. They want us to pick up some kind of rock. Or something. Hmm. Okay, well, question is, is that enough? All these six house amulets, what do I do with them? Okay. Uh, 500 right now. Five forty. Cool, let's do it. Ebony short sword. 102, <clears throat> 5.02. You're loved though, my mister. I don't know if I can do anything. See this ash statue. Should I pick this up as well? Yeah, okay. We'll drop it on our, our friendly dude. So glass halberd, that's a spear. It's basically a spear, right? Um, yeah, the condition, it has less condition, but much less weight. <clears throat> you could probably just get it. It also does more damage. Well, kind of. 
you could get away with presumably um yeah let's let's just lay down just carry some hammers with you you know the weight would still be better the the weight distribution all right well let's uh let's leave divine intervention we'll offload some of this stuff Okay, where are we now? Buckmoth. Cool. Makes sense. Um I'd be happy to talk. My pleasure, really. Okay, you. Hmm. You don't have very much though. Although maybe I could sell you some of these potions, some of these crap potions. Store fatigue. Reflect, Fire Shield, Fortify Endurance. Uh, what about... No, wait. Yeah, the Grurn guy did this. I think he just used lightning. I think that was his that was his thing. So 88. Um Can I do I don't know. 95? Mercantile skill increase. That's good. And I think I should be well, no, maybe not. Okay, what do you You have money? 200. That's even worse. It's even worse. Down to 503, though. Um. Greetings to you. A pleasure to meet you. Imsen the Dreamer. Do you have any more work? Oh, no. Maiden's token. Okay, never mind. We're gonna run out of strength or something here in a second. Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, over encumbered now. Still? Oh, because that's the wrong one. Right. I wasn't using Mighty Blows. I was using Divine Intervention. So I just teleported back a few feet. That's fair. 570 now. Uh, 114, yeah. Well, it's anywhere from, what they say, 5 to 20? Okay, we're, we're going to fight. Oh yeah, they're going after it. Well, come on then, dude. Ugh, yeah, it doesn't last... ...very long, but it lasts... ...long enough... ...for a little bit. We need to get to... Okay, let me take a look at my stuff. Right, if I just want to get rid of... Well, yeah, if I sell that, that's fine. Right, we'll go to the smith. You seem like very good company. It's because I am. I'm awesome. Are you the smith? No. Nope. You're a lot more refined. Where? Oh, Jesus. Like there he is. Oh, so close. Well, here's a fine one. Speak freely. All right, eighteen hundred. Awesome. Here, take take this blade. Bam. Twenty two oh eight. Imperial dragon scale helm. Right, right, right. Medium, medium, medium. Boots of blinding speed. Right. Orcish boots. What is he wearing? Oh, he must be wearing the, um... Ordinator boots, then. Uh, well, okay. Look at all those house amulets. What do I do with those? Again, I don't know. Um... 
I mean, I could purchase these, the Firebite Stars. My thought is go to, well, I want to go to Balmora to drop off some of this stuff anyway, right? Like the book and, and figure out what the deal with the shield is. What do you think, Manny? Let's purchase these stars. Okay. Down to 21. Redder and Watchman's Helm. Why do you have this? Uh huh. Should I just purchase arrows? 150. So this is what, 15 pounds? Yep. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. Uh. Oh, I see. We're, we're still too heavy. Or, yeah, damn it. Well, yeah, it might be, it might not be something I can do with him. Uh, right, my meanie? I mean, because I'm going to keep this stuff anyway. Do you have silver stuff? You have steel throwing knives. Iron throwing knives. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. Well that's that's a little a little better, I guess. I don't <laughs> Okay, well I think we're heavier actually than we were, so that's not a lot of help. Let's see. Okay, well. Alright, we're gonna go to Balmora. Boom. All right, and that helps with the... Yeah, we're still over encumbered, but we recharged a little bit on the way. Right, Mr. Manicat? All right. Why walk when you can ride? Well, you can't ride me around the city, so I have to do something. All right, we're going to run to Wayne, because Wayne's my bro. I give him all this cool... What can I help you with? I like what I see. Oh, yeah. It's because I'm a sexy beast. You can't fix me. Don't even... <laughs> Don't worry about it. Alright, so... Right, we're gonna sell... The throwing knives. We're gonna sell... All the throwing knives. We're gonna sell the shard arrow. We're gonna sell these steel arrows. Um... Right, so... I mean, oh yeah, we'll sell the Firebite Stars. See these things, these, I mean, there's no way to really do anything with them because he doesn't have the money. Um, sold him a lot of stuff though. A lot, a lot, okay. What do you think, Mr. Cat? You look so tired, kind of. Um. Well, I guess that's fine. Can I do, hmm. Dude, I don't know. 
Right, I'm still using these Imperial Steel Gauntlets. Do you have anything cool? Orcish is medium. Regular steel is not as good. Imperial Steel is better. That's okay, I'm, I'm fine with cobbling together my, you know? Oh, but Colovian fur, that's the best. You don't know what fur is until you've worn Colovian fur. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, all right, let's do, let's see if we can do 450. Offer is refused. 440. All right, this is better. All right. So, yes, let's go to our our truest bro. The bro that's such a bro. This could be a He holds everything even though he's dead, right? Okay. Oh, it's a glass tower shield. As opposed to just a glass shield. Interesting. So the weight is the same. However, this has higher defense and higher condition and more value. That's interesting. And the Indoril shield, though, is... Strange. Like, why would you equip that when you have... Oh, that was... That was not good. But I bet you can make this bigger. Alright, what about... Uh, what these? The six house amulets. What do I do with those? Oh, yeah. Ebony staff. Ebony longsword. Glass longsword. Multiple jink blades. See, all this stuff is just too mage bane. That's not bad, but for 10 sec. Well, then again, 10 seconds when you're in combat with one of those ash slaves shooting at you or whatever, that's also not bad. And then there's this, which just straight up does poison damage in addition. But this is where it's at. Resist magic, because magic is our biggest problem right now. Although, to be fair, this has a third of the armor rating, and so physical damage would become much more of a problem. But also our heavy armor is higher level, so... Alright, well, let's drop off the Ebony Short Sword. We'll drop off the Ebony Spear, because we can't sell any of this stuff. Cle keep the axe. What does he have equipped? Is this what he has equipped? Ice is black shirt. The hair shirt. Yep. And then some of these six house amulets, I guess. I don't know why they're different. I bet this one's from um, the dude that gave me Corpus, though. That's what I would wager. All right, how am I doing on weight? Oh, let's give him the book. And all the corpus meat, right? Annotated annuad. No, see, we did pick it up. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll sell it then. Uh, and what about seven curses, lost prophecy? Ash statue, I'll just, you can hold on to that, that's fine. And... What else? Oh, the... Right, Ebony. Yeah, we gotta see our girl. See if we can sell some of that stuff. Where was the... Where was the corpus meat? Oh. Okay. Anything else? Anything else we want to upload or offload or whatever? I don't know. I don't know. We just need to use more of these. The soul gems, right? Bone Lord, Storm Atronach, Dramora Lord, Skeleton Champion. 
Okay, so Bone Lord here is 20,000. Bone Lord here is 6,000. So it depends on the gem. It's not the soul? That's a little confusing. But if we see a Golden Saint, definitely do some of that. There goes Manny. Are you okay, mister? Scamp, Dramora, and here Bone Lord is 4,000. Flame Atronach, 4,000. I guess we could. I guess we could just do, because we have... Be careful, mister. Be careful. You okay? You're going to jump over there? Just be, be careful, all right? Yeah, don't don't jump if you don't feel confident, okay? I'll move a little bit so you can uh, use the arm of the chair. There you go. There you go. Okay, so he is going for the heated cat bed. All right, that works. That makes me happy. All right, let me take a dr drink of my rum because I still have a bunch of this stuff, the sipping rum, the clear stuff. It's not good if you're into rum. Um, Appleton Estate, way better. This Diplomatico, the Blanco, is just terrible. At least with the Appleton Estate, you have a little bit of color. You know what I mean? It's not sweet. It tastes more like popsicle sticks, but it at least has something. Whereas this is just like, it's like gin or vodka. It's it's very, it's just straight alcohol. It's, it's, a little, it's harsh. Okay. All right, so it's not the most terrible thing in the world. Let's go to uh, Ajira. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, 2400. How much? Let's see. <clears throat> I don't know. We'll sell one of those to Wayne as well. You've got my ear. Let's hear it. Cool. Yeah, I would imagine the Indoril or the hmm. I don't know what the best armor set would be. To Stay what as do long I owe this pleasure? Like. It would be a privilege to talk with you. Well, thanks, pal. What about one of these? 929. Can we do a thousand? Awesome. Is he wearing it? I think he is. Yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna give you another at some point. All right, to Ajira, because, yeah, the ebony... Me with your attention, Outlander. Ebony is 10 pounds. <clears throat> also, I need someone... Oh, heavy armor is at 100. Acrobatics, that's fine. Basically, we're trying to get all the strength... To what do I owe this pleasure? ...things out of the way. All right, we'll sell you, sell you the hound meat, racer plumes, crab meat, ebony. Ebony is the big one. Um, oh, you don't have any gold. Crap. Never mind. Cancel. Can I? In Should that case, I will be happy to oblige. See if we could do. Should I just do a day? See if we can just do 24 hours. Okay. Not getting it. Should you need something, I will be happy to Our sugar is yours, friend. Okay, 800. All right, so raw ebony. 
Do I have any more potions I want to sell? I mean, the answer is yes, but... I also have the Cure Poison, which maybe I should, you know... Oh, I have lots of Cure Poison. All right, cool. Really? Just 139? Well, I guess that makes sense. Okay. That... All the Ash Salts. The Fire Salts. Oh, the Drew Wax? Yeah. Let's see if we can give up a bunch of that. Uh, any more? Yeah, okay, perfect. Offer. Excellent. I don't know how much gold I have to now, but I it's pleasure. never enough. And then... How back to Wayne. Well, first we're going to grab more of that Indrill set. I I know it sounds... Oh, athletics. I know it sounds... Is that another... Yeah, okay. Light armor. Oh, block. Yeah, we're gonna... Oh, geez, long blade. Or block. We're gonna get block any second. That's cool, though. I, I know it sounds stupid, and yes, it's a pain in the ass that the... Outfitters do grab all of your best stuff and wear it automatically, so you can never repurchase it. However, I kind of like selling them this stuff to outfit them, if that makes... Does that does that sound stupid? The Indoril Shield. We could probably do both. Also, I want to know where this... Uh, some of those... Uh, what was it? The little add-ons, right? Supposedly somewhere there's adamantium armor and other stuff. Welcome. Please Stay don't as be long shy. As you like. I'm listening. Would be a privilege to okay, 2,000. So let's give you this and that. Oh! All right, then. Um, hmm. uh, that's not very much, though. Hmm. Yeah, look at all those bows I was selling to him. Back in my misspent youth. Storm Forge. Clearly a... Uh, Unique item. Uh, I mean, I guess we could... I guess we could grab some of these. How many would I have to get to frickin'... Oh, jeez. A lot. <sighs> Maybe that's okay. Oh, wow, did we just purchase all of them? And our... You know what, that's fine. We'll, uh, I mean, maybe we'll, maybe we'll use them, maybe we won't. I don't freaking know. I... <laughs> you know? Or I could just... Uh, I could just do this, and I could be like, no, you know what, I'm gonna... I'm gonna hold on to the shield for now. Or maybe the... Maybe hold on to the gauntlet. Right? Okay, 13. Let's see if we can bring it to 14. Just for round numbers sake. Alright, cool. And I think he... Yeah, he did equip the shield. Honestly, doesn't look that impressive. I wonder what determines 
citizen. What determines, you know, what they equip? Or, you know, what's the highest priority? Maybe, maybe faction stuff? Because it's not, it's not raw numbers. I don't know, anyway. Also, bookseller, yeah. Okay. And where was that, um... This one. Hospitality... We'll, we'll execute one of these writs, and then we'll get back to them, and we'll toss the other one, because one of them I need, and one I don't. If I'm remembering right. Okay, barter. I need to sell you this. 36. Up to? Sure. Um, yeah. I think, I know this maybe sounds stupid, I want to do, I kind of want to play through this game again. But although, I'll, you know, here in another hundred hours I might change my mind, but, um... <sighs> let's, let's save real fast. But maybe be a merchant. No. Because... That way you could focus on the combat skills and get them up without worrying about leveling. Or maybe I should just go straight... Just see what happens when I level inefficiently, you know? That might be interesting as well. Alright, so I don't... Hall of Maki. I think that's... That's where we were. Not let's uh let's put that away. Let's get this amulet of stamina. You don't want to recall outside just by mistake. Alright, we were down there. I don't know if we explored. Um I'm stuck on the walls. Was, uh... This was the wrong place, wasn't it? Whoa, that was cool as hell. You know, I saw... I... It, it's really interesting to log out of your YouTube account and just see what... see how the YouTube thumbnails are and you and that's kind of when you realize that not only is YouTube garbage but also people are as well which <laughs> right this is this an ash statue maybe it's a big one I don't know oh no this what this was where we were okay um because you see all these different thumbnails and they're all the clickbait crap and, you know, all that stuff. Okay, so I guess we have fully explored this little area. Uh, so now it's... That's where we came from. We have to decide, do we go through the Nabith waterway? Which, probably not. Probably not. That would be my guess. That's probably where you're supposed to end up after going through maybe this other place, right? So let's try the Vault of Arrowed. Also, it's a vault. Treasure is in a vault, so, you know. Man, I love this stamina amulet. Like, the best thing ever. We'll, we'll wait for a second to, uh, to go in there in case there's something on the other side, but... But, man, it refills 30% of our stamina. 30 to 50% just on its measly five charges like that's it's freaking outstanding yeah ah oh, the, the peace a little quiet by the way uh, apologies if there's ads on these videos there must be but 
every single, all of these songs, they're all copyrighted. So every single video is copyright claimed. And I'm just like, I, I'm not going to go through and, and dispute every single one. I could, and a lot of time it works just because people don't, it's just an, it's an automated thing, right? And they're not, they're not paying attention and someone, it goes in this random person's email and they're, or whatever. I don't know how it works, but they don't care most of the time. It's automatically done if anyone disputes it after 30 days of them ignoring it. They're just like, whatever. Because that's when they make all, that's when people make all their money. They get all their views and usually the first 48 hours, I think. I play the long game, and I don't do this for money. See? Holy cow! Take that, you fat belly bitch! <laughs> you know what? You're, you're big boned. You're healthy. It's okay. You're, I'm not fat, I'm big boned! That's what all the women say. That's the same symbol we screw we saw in white. Which okay, so I assume it's a person, right? Like is this the head and then there's maybe horns and the face? You know, I've seen Dagothur's picture. He has the mask. That golden thing. Do you think his do you think his whole face is missing like the ash zombies okay we have two wooden doors let's try this one yep there's another one of those dudes uh well let's try let's try it Okay, not enough charge. Ice bolts. Okay, so his magic is pretty... Uh, not enough charge. What about shock balls? Oh, he's actually shooting at us. Alright, uh, well, let's, let's heal. Let's do some healing. You think he's gonna come out? There he is. Okay, let's, uh... Let's use one of these standard... Nope, that's must restore magicka. Restore health. And... Lord's Mail. Okay, so we got Lord's Mail. Cure poison, restore health. Wait, doesn't the Lord's Mail also resist magicka? I'm invisible, but... Oh! Oh! It knows where I am. Well then, how about this? How about a little of that, you son of a bitch? And it just straight up turns into a skull, which is really interesting. And the other thing is... Um... So do you think this is a different race? Or do you think it... Because it actually has something, right? So does the corpus turn... Like when he dies, he just... All he becomes is a skull. Right? So you become an ash slave, then an ash zombie where it like hollows out your face. Then you become one of the low-level Dagoth things where it grows the little elephant trunk out. And then does it consume your whole body and all that becomes bone? And then more tentacles? The sort of life cycle of the... Oh, we got a key, right? Hmm. 
Right. More of these symbols. So we get a better look at it now. A little something in the middle. All right, what do we have here? Steel Greaves. Nope. Adra and Daedra. Uh, we'll, we'll take it. I mean, I guess. I don't know why I want to take every book I come across. I just want, want to. Right, a spinning wheel. We got to figure out... <sighs> like, you're talking old, old... Oh, that's, uh... It's empty. Literally empty. Oh, God, am I stuck? Uh, I might be stuck. Can I crouch and... and... Oh, there... Okay, that works, though. Alright, what do we got? Restore strength. Silver claymore. Alright, I guess. I'm not happy about it, but I will pick it up. Dude, I'm like a drug addict where I'm like, I need this for my latest fix. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, seriously, right? I'm like, what garbage can I sell? What can I pawn for the money to afford my next whatever? Lower Kogarun. So is this not the right way? Huh, you know, we didn't, um... There's definitely some stuff. Another one of these ash statues. Oh, uh, oh, oh, hey, Bone Lord. All right, cool. Let's, um... I need the spell. Epi Epiphagies... I like how their name, too. Akash's Lock Splitter, like, that's what he's known for. All the doctors I work with, they, they get so... One of them, one of them that I know. He's like, I was gonna have this thing, it was gonna name it after, this technique after myself, and... You know, my mentors... You know, I told it to my mentor, and he told it to his kid, and the kid got it and got written in the book. First, like, he's, he's pissed. He's like, it was going to be named after me. And this, my, my mentor's son stole it out from me. Like, it's legit. Is it on touch? Uh, maybe not. Okay. Trapped a soul. Awesome. Bone Lord. Five things of bone meal. All right, what do we got? The ash statue. So it is, yeah, it, it's just a smaller version of those things, which makes sense. Oh, grave dust. Yeah, take it. Take the gold. Take the fortify, whatever. Telvani dust adept helm. Cool. Let's see what it looks like. Also, yeah, let's take a look at the Bone Lord, Soul. Strange. I think, I think in Oblivion they fixed that, right? Where the souls are... Each of these soul gems can carry a specific size. Right, so you can get a bat, which is like one of the smallest ones. And it can get put in a big one. But... A big one, like a Bone Lord or an Ogrim, can't get put into a small one. It needs a, you know. But here, I guess it, I guess it can, which is very strange. So it's not just the gem itself that factors into the enchantment. I would imagine it's also the soul, the quality of the soul. Very odd. Um, right. So we picked up this helm. That is cool looking. There's some really awesome looking, um... Stuff in here, you know? Like the armor sets, you know what I mean? They're, they're just awesome. Everything is awesome. Everything is awesome! Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at all that. 
All these gold things. Am I going to take all these? Yes. Because it's made in the symbol of... Or, you know what? That's probably too much work. Too much work to pick all that stuff up. Detect key. Instead, I'll pick that up. Exquisite robe. It's 80, though. Let's take it. We can clothe our shopkeepers in it. Wait, was there... Did we go that way? Oh, we did. I bet the key picked up is uh, for the waterway. So you could potentially bypass this whole area. That would be my guess. What are we at? 46 minutes-ish? Right? Because Holofisto, Nabith Waterway. All right, let's go to the let's go to the waterway then. Why would they be guarding the shield? Dun 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 dun. Mer mer mer. This is very strange. It's like a ruined city. It's like the, the sewers under Vivek. Super sketch. I think that was the one we just did. We'll save over. That's fine. If not, it's cool. That is a Frost Atronach. Do we want to use a gem thing on that? I don't know. That's what happens. Mess with the bull, you get the horns. That one goes underwater. That's got to be an ash zombie, I would imagine. You know, it's interesting. Where's my block skill? I guess I haven't blocked. I assume if I block, it'll fill up the rest of the way. And yet, when I go like this, it sort of blocks automatically, or it seems to. Which is interesting, and kind of nice. Alright, uh, well, there's the water. Go into the water, live there, die there. Death clock. Awesome. I know they're a parody band, they're, they're like, a parody of metal death metal, but I find the music really awesome, so it's fine by me. Uh, oh yeah. And then, um, what's the ring of Khajiit? It was interesting that the dude saw me. You know, invisibility didn't cause, did not cause him to disengage, but maybe it's because I was not necessarily poisoned. I don't know what was going on, though. Really? Nothing in this crap? Well, that's useless. Also, why is this water so clean? Maybe because no one comes down here. Only the dead. The dead don't poop. Because that's, that's the thing, right? Waterways like this? We're not waterways. They were sewers. This would be... Waste. You know, that's why moats, back in olden days... It wasn't water that you could just swim through. It was... Sewage. It was... That's where people threw all their bedpans and stuff. 
you know, sanitation back then was not... Ooh, moon sugar. Wow, it's a lot of moon sugar. Salt rice. Excellent. Wow, Azira is going to be happy. And goblets, don't care. Interesting enough, there was only one sixth house goblet that I found, right? The corpus weepings, um... Skeletal corpse, gold, bone meal, steel short sword, yeah, okay. Let's go check the other one. Wait, hang on. Oh, I could tell. Cat hair in the thing, in the, in the mouse. Where is... There was that other skeleton. Oh, and we got... Five hound meat. Meh. Steel. Uh, sure. More hound meat. Iron short sword. Hey, buddy. Oh, you. What is that? Is that poison? Oh, sorry. I kind of sound earwig. Ash slave. Oh, it's... actually, that's okay. I thought that was the, um, the soothing balm. The soothing sounds. Well, that's a Dagoth, presumably. It's a Dagoth. Hmm. Right, so that one goes underwater, but then it overlaps with this and goes somewhere. I... These might connect. Who knows? But I bet this goes onward. Right, because there was a key. Well, let's see what the deal with this guy is. I'm gonna run a little bit. I'm up, he sees me, I'm down. Oh, never mind, he sees me. Oh, this guy's tough. Frost. Ash Ghoul. Oh, so the generic form of that guy. Understandable. I see. Iron spear, bone meal, and some gold. You can you can have your spear, dude. All right, let's see if we can go. I assume this links up, right? This probably connects. Let's uh, save here just in case. Well, not so bad. Not so bad. So this must be the wrong place then for that key, right? Because unless that's the way forward, which it could be. It might just be. Well, Let's end here. This is as good a cliffhanger as any. Unless you want to go through... You know what? Let's go through real fast. We'll see where it ends up. If it's nothing, then we'll have to figure out where to go. If it's something... 
then, oh, well, that was anticlimactic. I was expecting, and yet, okay, well, maybe, maybe less anticlimactic, right? Because here's some corpus dude. Um, oh, crap. I thought I was jumping, but I guess I missed the jump. Oh, and he... You know, it's funny, right? I work with, uh... So I work with vascular surgeons, and, um... <laughs> we see diabetes and other vascular issues, like issues with your veins and arteries. Or, or just fat people, people that don't take care of themselves. Their legs look like this. Their arms look like this. And so we we had some dude that was 450 pounds who looked, whose leg looked like this. And they're like, we need to take a look at his, you know, arteries or veins or whatever to see what, if there's blockages and maybe we fix them. And I, I saw it, I'm like, it reminds me of this. And I pulled up a picture, showed the vascular surgeon. She's, she's a pretty... She's a bitch. She's a huge bitch. But, um... But she looked at it, she's like, Why would you play something so disgusting? I showed some other people, they are like, Yep, that's exactly what it is. It's kind of funny. Well, and there's your corpus weepings, too, if you, if you want them, you know? I don't know, it's just... It's just funny. It's like that's that could be you one day. It could be me. Hopefully not. Hopefully not. Hey, buddy. Huh. Dagoth Rala. So this one... No. So if they're named, they have this. If they're an Ash... If they're an Ash Ghoul, they don't have the... Amulet. But if... Yeah, what's the deal? And see, there it goes. It unequipped my, my thingamabob. Scuttle. Awesome. Oh, that's the... Sure. Still have... Well... Not that much time, honestly. That's the way forward. Actually, I bet that's where the lock goes. Or that's the lock that the key goes to. Alright, so let's jump in here. We'll get this. We'll swim around, I guess. Oh, of course. Of course. Why would these have anything? Why would you play a game that's so disgusting? You know, and I realized earlier today, or I think it was today, all these people that are, they, they call for the censorship of Kogarun Charma's breath or Karma's breath, that call for the, uh, all the censorship of all this stuff, they're like, they're like, this is terrible, and, and I will physically attack you for writing something so terrible. It's like, you're... You want to censor it because you're the problem, not us normal people. And and that's kind of the big issue is us. It's the permissiveness of being nice. We see these intolerant people. And we're like, well, you know, all right, all people's opinions should be respected and all that stuff. And, you know, do unto others as you would do unto you. But in reality, that's a, unfortunately, that's the immature perspective, right? That's that's the child's perspective. The reality of the situation is you can't tolerate these people. 
you know, you, you look... I'm not saying wipe them out. I'm not saying anything of the sort. But you have to understand... You need to figure out what's best. And if these MFers are, you know, calling for violence, calling for censorship, calling for whatever, it's like you you need to kind of step back and be like, what do they want to do? Are they a threat? If left alone, are they going to become the cancer? And then as an adult, sometimes you got to get your hands dirty. You know, these these people, they live in a fantasy world. They're like, it's terrible, you know? Why would you play something so disgusting? Meanwhile, they're watching, they're obsessed with true crime. They're like, oh, what happened to that little girl? Was she, was she violated before she was murdered? Ooh. They're gossiping about real life tragedies. They're the terrible ones. Reality isn't, reality is horrible, but they want to shame us for dealing with fan and it's not like we're taking pleasure in this either it's like corpus is horrible but they want to shame us for entertainment that reflects the world but they're the truly horrible ones that's that's why i'm just like f both sides of the political debate because they both want to censor and ban video games you know what i mean Anyway, though, let's let's kind of dial it back. Let's end for today. That is it for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. Really do appreciate it. Really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. As always, guys, questions, comments, concerns, good, bad, or indifferent, let me hear them. Do try and read them all, assuming they're not memory hold. I do try and respond to all of them. This, uh, this rum is kicking. It's kicking in already. Um... What is your guys' unique puzzle moment for today? I guess I'll say the rum. I didn't quite expect it to be this potent, but maybe I'm just tired. Maybe I need to eat or something. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, either way, that's my unique puzzle moment, even though it's terrible. It's terrible rum, but it's, the effects are still good, I guess. I like them. Um, hopefully your guys' unique puzzle moment just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys. Take care.